In a far corner of northwestern China, a car drives along a wall lined with barbed wire. A video report the New York Times made in Kuaitun, Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region, paints a bleak picture of how Uyghurs live and work. Times claims Uyghur workers were forced to leave their hometowns in southern Xinjiang and made to work here. The Times decided to do its filming secretly, even though Kuaitun Sanitation Station is open to the media. It's all about making it look like there's some sort of big conspiracy going on. They use, uh, quote, uh, the secret footage and things like this. You know, putting things in, taking things out, the hushed voice, this type of thing. I mean, they're, they're speaking on, <laughs> on a videotape. Um, but it's very conspiratorial. It's made for drama. We decided to talk independently to the workers and used translation apps on our phones to communicate. I prefer here because the conditions are better. My sister told me they were recruiting. We can ask for leave to go home if we want to. The New York Times suggested the workers could earn much more back in their hometowns. They always have something to do here, so they get paid constantly. In South Xinjiang, they may have something to do from time to time, so the income is unstable. That means they can't make a thousand yuan in a month. Our sanitation workers live in comfortable dormitories. We provide 24-hour hot water supply. They can take a shower in the dormitory. 